Um. So Sky Williams and I, he was in the, he was in the first championships of fire, champions of fire. And then he would, uh, but, but I had been prepping for all the games. So champions of fire was like, you play 10 different games, like mobile games and you compete against every, everyone else. Right. And it's like a leaderboard for every game. And I was practicing a bunch of them, so I was like really, really good at some of them. But then I don't drive, and I've never played racing games, so I am trash at racing. So there were two racing games in that, in that tournament. And David was helping me prep for it. I played the tutorial, and I got third. <laughs> like in the fucking tutorial race, right? And then in the next one, I, I don't remember, but I lost on the, like, the first round thing, and then... When David played, he got first. And I was like, you know what? I don't think I should... I don't think I should allocate time and energy into this. Because I think I'm just doomed at this game. You know? Like, so all I did was play the tutorial. Which I, which I did poorly in. And then I tried to do one race, which I couldn't even finish. And then that was it. Anyway. The tournament starts. And it's me versus Sky Williams. And he's like, oh, I didn't even play this game. And I was like, oh, me neither. I, I, I only played the tutorial, like, just now. And I'm horrible at it. But I'm pretty sure you, like, take the... You take the um, iPad or the phone or whatever it is. And then you, like, you, like, steer with it. And so we get on stage. And I'm steering. And I'm crashing at the walls over and over and over. But somehow, I'm still beating him by a lot. And the whole time, he's flaming me. The whole fucking time he's flaming he's like liar she's a liar i can't believe you would stoop so low and lie to me and what happened was just actually really unfortunate it was like a misunderstanding because his ipad was not set correctly whoever it was on stage did not set his ipad correctly because you're he had to fucking do it with like like he had to steer like manually whereas i was like driving You're which is much control. easier yeah. yeah yeah it was way easier to like drive i was still driving at the walls and i'm pretty sure i got last out of everyone except for him but for the whole time he called me a liar and we're on stage and it's streamed and he's just like laying into me and then the judges are kind of like egging it on they're like oh hafu hafu is just destroying sky and sky the whole time is like oh my god she's such a she's i can't believe you would stoop so low like you want to win so bad you're such a liar you know the whole fucking time and i'm like on the verge of tears because i'm like i didn't fucking lie like i, I would never do that that's scummy like i, I don't i don't try to have bad sportsmanship like that right i would never like sabotage someone before they go on stage and then afterwards, afterwards, she, he, he looks at me like when we're getting off stage and getting off the mics, he's like, you bitch. And then I saw I like try to clear things up with him. I'm like, what the fuck was that? Like, what was that? What was that? And then he gets really, really heated and then walks away. And I, I step in front of him. I was like, no, I just want to talk. Like, why did you do that? Why did you do that? And then uh, I don't know. I actually ran off and I cried. <laughs> I was like, that was horrible. It was like a horrible experience for me. Cause like I just got called a liar and like a cheat pretty much the whole time on stage and it just sucked. Okay. And then fast forward to the either later that day or the next day, Sky had dropped out and accused me of hitting him of like physically abusing him essentially. And I was like, what <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> I mean, if you don't know who Sky Williams is, he's like, what, he's like six feet fucking, I don't know, he's like six five or something. I'm five six. I weigh like 120 pounds. You know, he is like triple my size. I'm not going to hit him. I'm, I, I, don't, I, don't, I can't even like hit a, hit a bug. <laughs> and anyway, the whole time I'm just like, this is so bad. This is so bad because I've had experiences trying to tell my side versus a content creator who's a bigger name and I've always lost. So I was really, really scared that it was, it was him versus me. And he, he demanded he like to take my prize money or to get Amazon to take my prize money and, or, or something like that. And I was like, what? And he's like, no, 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 I'm going to like sue. I'm going to sue. And I was really, 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 really stressed out of my mind. But then it was actually Pokey who 
told me she was there because it was Pokey and Yasuo next up on stage. So they were like around the area backstage. And she said she saw him. She heard him say, you bitch, you lying bitch, like to my face. And then like she saw the whole thing. She know she knew that I didn't I didn't do anything. <laughs> and she's like, if he really does come out with a video like accusing you, I got you. And that made me feel so much better because I know that like Pokey's word would mean something. And I've always been so fucking grateful to Pokey for that because I was like super fucking stressed. Like anytime you fight a fan base that's bigger than yours, you lose. You fucking lose. It doesn't actually matter what happens. You lose. <laughs> and yeah, just having Pokey there. Oh, and then and then David came later and I was crying and I was telling him about it. And it was nice because he was there to comfort me. But yeah, that was a long, 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 long time ago. Three years ago now. Three years ago, though. Okay. But yeah, yeah. I mean, there was never anything that came up about it. Just that he randomly dropped out of the tournament. And um, I mean, there was a lot of stuff that came about recently with him. But yeah, I, I don't know anything about that. But it was like a, such a weird fucking situation. Three years isn't a long time. It feels like a long time. 